NASA's Artemis program, geared towards sending astronauts back to the moon within this decade, is encountering significant delays. The pivotal Artemis III mission, set to achieve the historic feat of landing humans on the moon for the first time since Apollo, is now postponed to at least September 2026, shifting from its original target of 2025. The delays are attributed to challenges in the development of SpaceX's Starship, marked by two test flights in 2023 that ended in explosions. The timeline for SpaceX's lunar lander is extended, requiring a minimum of 10 refueling flights post the successful demonstration of Starship's Earth orbit capability. NASA expects regulatory approvals for SpaceX's third Starship test flight by February. Anticipated delays also extend to the engineering of spacesuits for lunar surface activities. The Artemis II mission, initially slated for November, is rescheduled to September 2025 due to issues with the heat shield and life support system of the Orion crew capsule. Despite these challenges, NASA is aiming for a 2028 launch for Artemis IV, focusing on a moon-orbiting space station named Gateway. This adjusted timeline signifies a substantial reassessment of expectations for the Artemis program, aligning with global lunar exploration aspirations, particularly from China. While China has made progress in robotic lunar missions, NASA Administrator Bill Nelson expresses confidence in the United States' lunar exploration capabilities. The announcement of delays in crewed Artemis missions coincides with setbacks in NASA's CLPS program. The astrobotic Peregrine lander, a component of commercial lunar exploration, failed after launch, prompting the company to evaluate disposal options as it exhausts propellant on its way to the moon.